thousands of artists. So, see now what will make you stand out? Everyone can sing. People can literally learn how to sing today, today, and go for vocal lessons and sing. So, what will make you unique? What will make people? What will make you get a fan base? Um, core listeners. That was a moment. Like that, that finding yourself moment. For that was hard because you're in the studio, 24/7, recording and scrapping some. There's some songs I'll probably have never ever release never. in my life because I know I was just trying my uh, my vocals because the more you record, the more you find yourself. You can't, it won't just come to you, you know. So that yeah, that point of finding is hard. It's really hard. Like every point, you find a different type or a different side of me. Um, Ojole was a totally different side of me for my very first EP. My very first EP was very soulful, very jazzy, even though it still had a gun element in there. Ojole, you know, completely is like, like from this to this. And I discovered myself, I'm like, wait, this is another part of me I didn't know existed. And then other songs in the studio. Oh my God, um, my my tape for Time to Lost. That's another discovery. I'm like, hey, I have different sides of me, and and it's amazing. It's like an amazing discovery every time you find, you know, that side of me. I feel like nature is also. Like within, you know, what we see why people go do yoga and then like lay a mat and then do all of that. I feel like nature inspires me. When I'm feeling unmotivated, I just go to the seaside, sit there, record, write. It inspires me. So I feel like putting that visual, I wanted to find a visual for that feeling. So I throw it into my music videos as well. There seems to be a lot of you know spirituality, a lot of soul in your your life. Definitely, you have like a very spiritual background, mm -hmm. don't you? Mm -hmm. You pray a lot. I do. I mean, I, I we've even had the prayer. In <laughs> me, right? No, we're not continuing if we don't pray. We don't pray before we start. Father, thank you so much for what you've done. Thank you for your mercies. We thank you for your grace. It's not by might, it's not by power that we're here. It's by your spirit. You know. But you know, there, are lots, there are lots of people that start off like that, mm -hmm. and then they feel like they get to a point where, you know, the music is stressing them mm -hmm. out or it's taking a lot of their time and they can't keep up. Mm -hmm. What is your what's your routine like? So I think, like you said, some people just start like that and then like it fizzles off. Mm -hmm. But for me, I feel like personally, I'm praying more now mm -hmm. because I'm telling you that the battle is getting tougher yeah the bigger you get or the more popular you become mm -hmm. the more eyes are on you yeah. it's scary it's scary you know and as a christian and from a christian background mm. i don't joke with my prayers no. because i i strongly believe that my talent is not mine so i always just go back to my maker i'm like listen i beg you don't you if you if i'm me. embarrassed you give it, it to me, you give it to me so don't <laughs> Come on, Come on. <laughs> you know. So I'm, I, I think I'm very, 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 very spiritual about it. There are times in your, in your career that you said after this time, hey, I have to make money. I have to make money. <laughs> I think it was after school. I'm like, listen, now the my friends are doing service. They're getting money monthly. Yeah. Me too. I have to make money when I play shows. I need to make enough money because. When your friends are working and you say I do music, your parents are like, oh, "Are you? Are you serious? Are you serious? You know, will you make money? I, when they, when you go for shows, my mom be like, I released album when I was probably in level three and level four hundred. I was in school. I didn't have money. I don't have money for music video. First of all, <laughs> I didn't even have money to record that studio right. session to pay for it. You know, I, I remember I had to ask my mom favors, and at the same time, I asked my mom. I have friends around me. Oh, can you help? I have people that have, like I have big ones. You know that. Um, maybe my mom has given me some money to go to school with. I'll take part of it. I'm going to pay for my studio sessions. I had friends that used to like worry me. Thank you. Used to worry me and be like, oh, Sina, let's go to the studio. I want to go with you. Okay, you are, I'll give you this. You know, it was a struggle. So, but music video there, we didn't have that money. I won't lie, we didn't have music video. It was my very first single. I was my very first. So please, 
Money? Nah. nah, nah. I need someone to call my own. Man, I'm a guy. Now I found someone to sit on my throne. Oh, from your Emma. Miss me from your Henne. Don't be your boy. Tell me, Johnny, it's you. When we were singing, there was one thing that I couldn't help but notice, mm -hmm. and that was your mood. My mood? Yes, it wow. was like the song meant something. Mm -hmm. It was just like a spiritual connection mm -hmm. for you. Like even just the just the strings playing, just mm -hmm. the drums playing, you know. Mm -hmm. It was it was something. And yeah. Yeah, definitely you've heard of it. What what for you, mm -hmm. what would your definition of music be? Wow. Yeah. Might sound very cliche, but it's like food for the soul. Mm. You know, I feel like you know how the soul we can't really see. Yeah, we can't see it. We can't. You know, we don't really know what it is. But right. I feel like music is from that deep part of us that we can't explain. Right. You know, when when there's an instrument playing, you don't know where it's from. You don't know, like music. You can't hold it, so it's it's in there somewhere. Mm. You know, and yeah, music is is, is a feeling. It's my life. It's it's it kind of like landmarks my entire life. Yeah. Um, there's a song for every period of my life. There's a song for every age that I I I, I become. Mm -hmm. You know. And yeah, it's just pinpoint who I am at every point. Okay. So I've always been supportive in everything concerning Sina. Uh, when we were younger, she used to dance, she used to do these cracking things and like, yeah, yeah. she buy sneakers, we go to town, buy sneakers, go and dance. But then I think after every girls, yeah, that was when she could sing like when she was young, but after every girls realized that she could sing and some of her friends forced her to go for Vodafone icons. Hey. Oh, yes. Beautiful. See, your life doesn't sort of allow you to be an introvert. I really had to find a good balance because I would go play a show and be extroverted and dancing and I'll come back home and it drains me. Right. Because I feel like I use so much of my energy and my everything. So it came at time I had to realize that listen, Sina, this is a different part of you mm -hmm. and this is who you are. It's okay, it's your work, it's your life, that's how you fine. make your money. It's yeah. fine. Fine. If you come back from your shows and you want to sleep, sleep. If you want to do something or do it, you know, don't let it weigh down on you and yeah. It be something about you, you bring me in When I see Oh your body be my medicine. Your first EP Metan Metanoia. Where did I even come from? What's that? Where did that? What's the what was it again? A journey of I think discovery. And I always say that my very first EP was like an experiment, it was like a journey for me of finding myself. So that's pretty much what it's called, like what, what it means, yeah. The thing about music for me is I actually even get songs from my dreams. Like I would, yeah, I would sleep and get a melody. I get, I get an idea, I get something. I have to quickly wake up and record, and record it on my phone. Yeah. So something like that, if I say I'm stopping, so when they come all I do, I feel like it will pile up and it will worry me. Yeah, you just blow you know, up one deal. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I don't think I don't think so. But you're really perfectionist. Well. You you I are. think I am. I think I am. After rehearsal, I'll go back home, go and listen to over and over again, and then I know that okay, the next time I'm correcting this and this yeah. and that, and yeah, I think I am. Now, how are you able to mix that with your normal life? Because I mean. You definitely have friends that you have to, you know, check up on, that you hang out with. Maybe your boyfriend in the story that we don't know about. But we yeah. don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think I have really great friends that understand. Maybe sometimes I can be MIA for months and then don't come back and be like, hey, so you even mind us. Yeah. They understand me because they're also working. Mm -hmm. Some of my friends are in law school. They are lawyers. Yeah. They are working, so it's like no one is demanding some sort of attention. You know, seeing I am minding me. No, everyone understands that. Okay, we are busy. When it's time for girls' night, mm. okay, it's time. You know, we link up, we have fun. Yeah. yeah what are those three things that influence your style? Oh, I, I don't know if it's three things, but most of the time I think about comfort yeah. first and just making a statement. Right. I don't like to box myself. Okay, I'm 
this is what I wear all the time. No, today I want to wear baggy jeans, tomorrow I want to wear a skirt, tomorrow I want to wear long ball gowns. I, 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 don't, I want like to always look like, yes, exactly how I'm feeling. And rehearsal is very comfortable for me. It's very studio vibe. So this is like literally what I wear when I'm going to the studio. My baggy, my sweat, you know, my, yeah. yeah just just easy. comfortable, easy, you know. I mean, you being a celebrity doesn't mean you can't live your regular yeah, life. A colored hair person, yeah, or ballet a crap. What's with the color? Is there a special color with the hair? Comes oh my, that's, that's where you want to go, okay. From, from way back, you oh, from know, way I'm not even looking at like, you, like, thing? the question, like, Nah, 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 yeah. no, if to be, to be fair, some other one just yeah. went colored. He wasn't colored as and first. And now he's colored. Now he's colored. So it wasn't, you know, you get it. Right. Yeah. 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 So is there a special <laughs> attachment to the color? I don't think so. Yeah, Apart from me so. maybe wanting to color my hair one day. Mm, what color is it going to be? I don't know. I feel like brown. You know, like some brown, golden yeah, like, brown. Like, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Oh. Fancy. Like what's Thank going you. on? I do. Thank you. Yeah. Do we cheers? Yes, we, we should. Cheers. To one night only with Sina Soul. Yes. yes. So deep and mm. awesome. uh, all I want to say is, I really love her. Guys, I, trust me, I love Sina more than any other person around me. I mean, I <laughs> yeah, I really love her. Like, sometimes I'm like, oh God. So what, what are we going to do? Like, you know, that kind of thing. Like, I love Sina so much. I want her to be at the top. I want her to have, like, all the best things in life because she makes me happy. She always says that my happiness shouldn't depend on her, but I always tell her that my happiness low key depends on her. I always tell God to make her like the person I want her to be, and I love her. She, oh my God. <laughs> okay, I'm getting overwhelmed. Like, but yeah, I really love her. I love her. Definitely, it's gonna be a beautiful show. Yes, um, what, yes. what do you, you want to tell people something? Um, to pull up. Pull up. Pull up. Um, don't wait. Yes, Ghanaians like that. Last minute. Oh, Sina, do you have a ticket? Can I get a ticket? See, don't wait. Oh, it's almost done. So, and it's going to be amazing. I'm not. I've not said the people that I'm going to share the stage with. But listen, there are a couple of artists that are going to be there as well. Um, special artists and people have songs with quite dumb people like people, proper live band crazy your favorite artist ever um, a different side of a you. different oh god it'll be crazy it'll be crazy I'm like I'm, I really can't wait I, yeah so please show up 11 February the Marriott see you you know what's funny Johnny Jordan and I actually have a song yo but it but but see he wasn't singing he was producing then no. We worked on a song in Nigeria. We need to re yes, we just need to reconnect and do it again. Johnny Drill, hit me up. Hit me yeah, but please your freestyle. Okay, okay, so I'll be waiting. I'll be waiting. I'll be waiting. Oh I'll be waiting. Waiting for you on the eleventh February. See. You.